Hi everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to prune a bay tree or bush. This one hasn't got a unit number, some of these skills you just learn at school because they're useful for the garden, but you don't necessarily get assessed on them. So I've got my PPE, I've got gloves to protect me from the blades, and I've got wellies. So let's have a look at the tools I've got. You're going to tell me which one do you think I need for this job. I've got handheld sacateurs, I've got bypass loppers, I've got anvil loppers, and I've got shears. So here are the two types of loppers. Anvil loppers work, the blade comes exactly together. It's a little bit stronger, but it tends to crush the branches. These are bypass sacateurs. They work, work like a pair of scissors where the blades go past each other and it makes a cleaner cut. These are handheld sacateurs. They work in the same way as the loppers where the blades go past each other. And then I've got some shears. The shears are just for cutting the surface of bushes or edges of grass. So today I'm worried that I don't want to introduce bacteria into my plant. So I want a clean cut. So which tools do you think I'm going to need? Okay, that's right. I'm going to use the loppers and the handheld sacateurs. So when I prune my bay tree, I don't want it to end up in a ball shape because that's not very natural looking. I'm just going to prune individual branches away. So some of them are smaller branches, so I'll leave them and I'm going to cut away some of these bigger ones. So let's have a go. Each time you have a look at the, the bush to see what, what you're going to cut off next, keep standing back and having a look to check what you've done. So this is the main one here. I'm going to cut this one to the height that I want the bush to be so then I can work around it after that. I want it to be about this high. I'm having a look for the much bigger branches. Cutting those away. You won't necessarily be able to see the cuts because the smaller branches kind of cover them up. Right, I'm going to have a stand back and see what I've done so far. Right, I can see a couple of big ones over here. Right, this up here is quite a skinny little one. So I can use my handheld ones for smaller ones. Have a stand back again. There's a little gap here, so I'm going to let that grow in. So I won't cut anything in the gap, so I'll just cut, cut around it. Bay trees and bushes are very strong growers, so you'd have to worry about being too gentle. Stand back again, have a look.
Keep an eye out for any damaged leaves. We've got some leaves that are kind of curling up and turning black here. That might be the start of a disease. I'm going to get rid of that one. Oh. Okay, so I've reduced the size and it still looks natural. So I'm happy with that. So, today you've been learning how to prune a bay tree or bush. And I'm Louise Davey from Coon Papa School.